Coming up next, it's a UFC women's flyweight division matchup. So here she is, one of the more prolific kickboxers to cross into the UFC in some time. She might kick harder than you, bro. Oh, yeah, she does kick so hard. And I mean, you look at the videos. The videos are all out there. And you watch this young lady landing these brutal leg kicks on the bag, landing the high kicks, the body kicks. It's, it's unreal to watch someone of this stature able to land and be as physical as she is. She's so aggressive in her approach. She's so comfortable in such tight confines that her opponents usually panic because they can't understand, as we can, how she can be okay when she's under duress as she is. I asked her to kick me in the leg at our fighter meeting on Thursday, and as you see, I'm still limping. So she packed some power, and her opponent better be ready for it here tonight. Well, drillers make killers, and nobody works her takedowns harder than this young woman. She has become a force in this division, and even though the opposition oftentimes knows what's coming, no one's able to stop that shot. Nobody's able to stop that takedown attempt. No one's able to stop that single leg. She said in the fighter meeting, I have thrown that takedown 5,000 times. Amazing. Over and over, I hit a single leg. Every day of the week, I hit at least 30 single legs. I'm like, well, is wrestling practice every day? She goes, no. I just want to make sure that I have a skill that is so dominant that no matter how much you practice it, you are not practicing it enough to stop me from taking you down with it. It is truly crazy to watch her approach to getting that single leg off. And her ability to get her opponents off balance in a mixed martial arts setting, as special as anybody in the sport right now, we'll see how it goes for her here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds of the UFC flyweight division. Introducing first, flying out of the blue corner. This woman is a kickboxer, making her professional debut here tonight. She stands five feet six inches tall, weighing in at 117 pounds. Dos Santos! And now introducing her opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This woman is a kickboxer making a professional debut here tonight. She stands five feet six inches tall, weighing in at 118 pounds. Fighting out of Seattle, Washington, USA, Hazardous. And when the action begins, a referee in charge, Eve Levine. The veteran Eve Levine draws the assignment here. All right, here we go with round one. Most people are not expectant of a grappler's delight tonight. These women can strike, and that's the type of fight they're expecting. A lot of times people believe when you put two strikers together, they end up wrestling, but these two women have told us, don't even think about calling any grappling. Tonight, you watch a kickboxing match inside of the octagon, so be prepared. What a punch. Nice straight right lands. You don't know when that leg kicks coming. Oh, you know about her kick. She's got him going tonight. Not there. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. She blocked the punch. Upstairs. That's what my grandmother says. Goodness gracious. Over and over. She is landing that head kick like Grandma used to say. Goodness gracious. John, I'd like to meet your grandmother. 
She sounded like a sweet woman. Well, she told us she wanted to kick more in this one tonight, and she is certainly doing that to great effect. She is doing it, and she's being very effective. She is winning the fight with her legs. And she connects with a punch there. We'll see if she can follow it up now. She's been landing at a super high rate. She's in a great flow right now. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Nice land there with the right punch. Easy to see why that is her weapon of choice. Great right hand. Nice land. Real nice body kick land. Nice kick by her there. It absolutely did hurt. I can tell you that as a fact. What a body kick. Ooh, big shot lands. Big knee lands there. Now they're both throwing with power. Oh! The right hand just misses. Oh, she works the body as well as anybody in this division. Another strike there, and these shots are really going to take their toll as this fight moves on. Oh, combination lands for her there. It's hard to recall a past fight of hers in which her striking has looked this fluid and pitiful. She's sharp as attack. Sharp as the attack. Everything is landing. She's doing a great job. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. What a punch. Liver kick. Well, she's got a good jab. Miss with it there. Oh, clinch position. Watch the knees and the elbows come down. Oh, that's a good right hand. That was a thudding leg kick. So again, they will clinch here. Thirty seconds to go in this one. Oh, nice! Fifteen seconds remain in the round. Back and forth we go. Nice strike. And that one certainly found the target. Round two straight ahead. All right, so what a round it was, DC. Take us through some of the highlights. Got to think her kicking game is going to be featured prominently here. She did decent work with the hands, but the kicking game was the thing that truly separated her from her opponent. She was landing kick after kick and truly slowing down her opponent in that round. All right, so here we go with our next round. Will the narrative be the same? In the previous round, it was all about her kicks, the power, the accuracy, really a sight to be here. I don't know why it would change. I don't think that her opponent has received the advice that she needs to make the necessary adjustment. She will go out there and start doing the same exact thing, which will in turn put her right back on the receiving end of those nasty kicks. Ooh, what a punch. The massive head kick. Good is that right hand. Oh, nice job to get the guard up there as the strike is blocked by Dos Santos. Another clinch position. Punch over the top. Just missed with the left there. Well, you hate to be overly critical because she has landed some good shots, but really nothing in terms of combinations. Tonight. She's got to let it fly, man. She needs to let the combinations fly. She's got to find the confidence in knowing 
that all that repetition, all that work with her boxing coach is going to pay dividends inside of the octagon. Beautiful strike. And just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. Does she have a soccer background? How about the kick there? I mean, she must have a soccer background because who kicks at heart? Stuff to take down, no problem. And they separate. Well, she has certainly picked up the pace here in round two and starting to find herself in the pocket a little bit. She was a little bit hesitant in round one. No hesitancy whatsoever here in round two. She has clearly found her rhythm and range. They continue to exchange. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Great punch. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Well, that left hand has been there for her tonight, not on that attempt. Oh, she blocked the punch. Leg kick. Give me a double leg. Give me a double leg. Look at it. Look at it. Now, shoot, shoot. Big kick land. And they separate. Big body kick land. Nice head kick. And just misses with that big right hand. Oh, she's really starting to put together some significant body shots here, attacking both sides now. Dos Santos gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. And she misses with the left punch there. Beautiful body kick. Now connects with the right. Oh, Big kick land. Huge right hand. You can never know what you're going to see with this young lady. Is she going to finish the fight? That's how you finish your fight. volume of strikes in this round as she continues to land and pour it on. It's amazing that she has been able to maintain this aggression with her striking throughout this fight. Well placed knee to the body. Straight punch land. Dos Santos gets hit by that leg kick, so maybe that one gets her attention. Real sneaky body kick. Oh! Check out some of the action from that round, DC, and what a display of striking for her. Yeah, she did a fantastic job of finding her spot, putting herself in position where she was the one landing and really dictating the pace of the fight. She did a great job of mixing up everything to get in control. All right, next round is now underway. Hopefully the action continues at a high level. Pretty good first five minutes. Pretty good first five minutes. Both of them can really pick it up. Let's see who decides they're going to lead the dance as we go forward. Oh, she just continues to land a high volume of strikes here, really just like she did in the previous round, and she does not seem to be slowing down at all. Good stick. She's just out of range with the big right hand. Beautiful body kick land right under the elbow. Nice. Well, she's been good tonight, but she missed without him. Dos Santos' lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Nice straight punch. Way to high. 
hide that leg. <laughs> She's going back to that patented straight right hand, unable to connect. Well, the right hand has been there for her tonight at times. Not that bad. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Oh, beautifully done there. She lands another strike to the body. She missed with that jab. Big punch lands through the middle. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. Oh, left hook. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Lands a glancing right hand upstairs. Quick entry here. Nice single leg entry. Rotates the head outside to a high crotch. Oh, nice job by her to posture up there. Now we'll see if she can maintain that separation. She has to recognize that her opponent will start trying to squirrel away now. But look for her big ground and pound. Well, you got to stay busy from the bottom position. Can't falter here. She's doing a nice job. Great punch landing at so much power. Man, the body work really starting to take its toll here. Obvious redness on that right side. Oh, she is absolutely getting lit up right now. She has certainly changed her approach here in the latter stages of this fight. She is trying to take the judges out of it. That'll certainly help that goal. Well, not sure if there's an injury or something, but here we are late in this fight, and she absolutely needs a finish or she's not going to win this fight. Well, she needs a finish. She's taking a beating. I mean, she's fatigued. She's exhausted. She sees a fighter that has gotten the best of her. I can understand the frustration, but she has to throw all that out the window and go and try to chase a finish. It's such a fast leg kick. Oh, she connected flush. Look at how she drives her knee right into her opponent's midsection. Oh, the right hand is there for her. Real quick leg kick. Visibly limping here. Nice liver shot, guys. She's been good tonight, but she missed with that one. That one was thrown to end the fight. <laughs> nice. Well, she continues to leave that head open, and she paid for it there. She's almost moving into the strike. She hasn't changed up her tempo, and she continues to keep her head on that center line. We'll see if she can make the proper adjustments here. Well, it's not considered a power shot or even a significant strike, but that jab looked pretty significant to me. When you land that jab like she does, it is a significant strike. To hell what anybody else says. Oh, nice jab. Kick to the body by Dos Santos. All right, so the fighters go the distance here tonight, and she really put it all together on the feet as we show you some of the highlights from the fight. It's all come full circle for this young lady. She said on Thursday that we would see a better version of her than we did the last time she was in the octagon. I will take that a step further and say that this is the best we've ever seen. She should win a pretty clear decision. Official decision now Ladies in. Ladies and gentlemen, after the three buff rounds, has. we go to the judges' scorecards for decision. All three judges score the contest. 30-27 for the winner by unanimous decision. Hazard. Well, you got to figure her challenges are only going to get stiffer from here, but she passed this test tonight. She is your winner by unanimous decision. And she needed this, right? This goes to the maturity of her career. The fact that she is growing and growing and growing and can win a tough fight over an extended period of time.